And now, uh, which is a start streaming? Let me see if my streaming software, okay, YouTube is not working. It's showing me so. So, we have live streaming right now. Well, welcome again. Uh, this is gonna be um, a different because I said that the last time, next time we'll do something with Sermo Saranya, the real creature that we did last week. But uh, we're not gonna do that right now what we're gonna do is um i guess these two guys remember probably the ones that love star wars as much as i do um the admiral mon calamari akbar well i'm gonna make a mon calamari my version of a mon calamari and um, since you probably re remember mon calamari's the Mon Calamari were these nice characters that I have here. Let me show you one. Well, probably you don't see it. It's like this. So that is a Mon Calamari. But the Mon Calamari looks like a fish or a reptile or an amphibious or something. It doesn't resemble him at all a calamari. Uh, by the way, do you know what the calamari words mean? Squid. So it's a squid. So yeah, let's see. This is a squid. Cute, right? It's nice. And also, this is a squid. Yeah. This is another kind of squid. And uh, another cute squid. They are so cute. They're nice. When they are small and they are trying to kill you, they don't try to, you know, engulf your boat or something like that. And this is another kind of calamari here, which is pretty much, pretty nice. And this is the kind of calamari they said. Is a Mon Calamari. I don't know, is uh, they just get it wrong because it's, I don't want to put the blame on nobody. <laughs> Sorry. But if I were the guy who did the design for these Mon Calamaris, or uh, this guy whose name is Mon Calamari, and it's probably you never try Calamari, which is squeak. I probably try to go for the squid side of the stuff. Trying to do a squid, huh? not a squid bar, because a squid bar doesn't look like squid. Squid bar actually looks like a octopus. He's an octopus. He's not a squid, because a squid don't have long tentacles. They have like a half tentacles. Octopus in the other side, they have long tentacles, but Anyway, this is, this humble guy said, it's not a calamari at all. This is some sort of a amphibious kind of fishy slash fish, not even fish. It looks like a reptile or something. And they said it's a mollusk or like invertebrate, but he has... And, and these are joints, so that means he has some sort of a whatever. Well, this is the Amira Mon Calamari, is the one that I'm gonna do or try to do right now, but not this version of the Amira Mon Calamari, is the, the squid version of the Amira Mon Calamari, which is gonna be the right version of the Amira Mon Calamari because it's a calamari, it's a squid, not in other way, another kind of animal. So let me uh, see in the chat how many people we have right now. Uh, so we get these guys out. And I have my chat. Really? my password cross works really anyway this nice okay Okay, 
welcome to this week on cigar. Feel free. Feel free to ask me anything. I will. I don't have Facebook, really. Why I don't have Facebook? I just don't get it. Oh. Hmm. Let me see my Facebook. Facebook. I don't have Facebook. Apparently, I don't have Facebook now. Oh, yeah. I have Facebook. Okay. I don't know why I don't have Facebook. Well, it didn't say that I have Facebook. Well, let's get back to the Amiron. So, this time, we are going to start doing this concert art. That's it. It's the first time ever that somebody asks you to do Mon Calamari. So, you said, okay, the name's Calamari sounds familiar. So, you just Google and find out this uh, dish made out of squid. So, you have to make a squid. So, yeah, let's just start doing the squid. And before doing this, let me remind you that this program brass was brought to you by me. I don't have any supporters, so please join the group of being my supporter and get in there and subscribe to this channel, please. And um, you know, one subscriber at a time, we are gonna get, hit the thousand subscribers, so then I can monetize these videos and do some kind of living out of this. Uh, besides, I'm huh, a freelance illustrator, but that will help you. And anyway, we're just online. Thank you so much for joining me. And let's start with the calamari. Thank you so much again. Um, well, as I told you, just for the for the guys that just uh, connect right now, just think that you are a concert artist and you are being asked to do a Monk Calamari after all. This is the first time that the guy, Star Wars you are working for the, the Return of the Jedi or, or probably one of those parts that we want to recreate a Mount Calamari guy. So you don't know, you don't have any idea about this guy. So you just do the most logical thing. You start thinking, okay, Calamari, hmm, what that name is mean? So you start Googling about the name Calamari and you find that the Calamari is a dish made out of squid. So it's a squid, so it's a mollusk. So you start researching about mollusk and about Calamari. So you know that you don't want an octopus, as the name is not octopus. It's not pulpo, no. It's not pulpejo, no. It's calamari. So you start researching the name, researching calamaris, which is squid, everywhere, and you see something that is fitting. Also, it should be some kind of hominite, because all of the guys in the Star Wars universe are by pill, they have two legs, two limbs, and sometimes they have uh, hands and fingers. And you don't know much about the fingers, but anyway, it's something that you just figure out later. But first, you need to construct this bipedal creature. So you have the calamari here. I don't know what I'm having in this area, this little thingy guy. I'm going to put it here. And yeah, let me put the camera right here. And you start trying to do their research. It's going to use a clear seal thing. Oh, by the way, I'm going to start using Krita. Uh, I'm going to show you something about Krita. And I've been doing some experimenting in Krita, and they, they were pretty good. Hey, by the way, did you see the, the new, uh, the new uh, cover in my Facebook, uh, the art of guestliness, and also in my uh, YouTube? That was made with Krita. I'm trying to do some Krita right now, trying to uh, 
to show you much as the what you can do in, in, in art and in digital art, international art, concert art, and creating cartridges using Krita out of the box, just using that, not twitching anything, and probably not creating any kind of new brushes, just using whatever is in stock. So let me see where I have the Krita. I have the Krita here. Oh yeah. I should have put it in the in the in the taskbar, but I don't have it there. Anyway. So I have Krita, Krita just just starting. And uh, yeah, this is gonna be uh, by the way, this is gonna be a new one. So let's go to the desktop. Okay, this is the Krita. Let me show you this guy. So yeah, this is now yet finished. So yeah. This is the guy I'm doing right now. Well, I started yesterday. Hope you like it. It's uh, some sort of like a dwarfish. It's still doing some some kind of thing. I finished the hair. I want the hair that way. I mean the, the hair on the beard. I want it that way. I want the the texture of this uh, this way anyway. This is what I'm doing with Krita. Let me show you what I did the last time. Yeah, this is what I did for the. Uh, this is the one that you see in YouTube. Actually, originally it was like this, but I had to make it smaller because YouTube. Yeah, this is the original. This was totally made in Krita. You can just twitch it or whatever and using the, the brushes. I'm trying to do this this experimentation instead of using like a 10 or 12 brushes and everything I'm trying to just stick to one two, or two brushes. Not much and try not to use much of these uh, layers for the effects but also uh, doing like uh, something a little more. Oh you remember this guy? Yeah, remember this guy? Yeah, it's finished. I just make a, a, a couple of little arrangements when I finish my uh, my thing and I put it online. And uh, yeah, this is the, this guy is. I'm not gonna use this guy, I'm gonna a new. So it's an A4, A4, I mean, yeah, it's okay. And I'm going to need my real pencil. This is the, the pencil that I always use. Oh, I don't have this. Oh, yes. oh. oh yeah, no swear. Wow, why do I look like that? I need to get rid of some weight. Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Anyway, uh, it's a camera. <laughs> Sorry. So yeah. So um, I wish I have like a one of this uh, like a camera, not on on this side, but uh, this a little closer. This is, for example, this is closest. This is closest. See. Is the lenses. I wish I have a 50 millimeters, but I don't have it. Hey, by the way, go to this place. Let me put it in the chat. Go to this place. Okay, this is coffee.com. Let me see if this is coffee.com. So much for this to this place 
coffee.com slash Chris Donas Art and buy me a coffee. I will appreciate that. I really appreciate it. So let's put this. I need this guy to look closer. Yeah. Okay. Oops. Yeah. Now I'm comfortable. So let's just start doing the calamari. So this. This is. So what size we want the calamari anyway? Well, this is. Yeah, I need it bigger. So what size this calamari anyway? So I need this calamari to be this guy. Have like a TDP belt or something, it looks like Batman. <laughs> it's a nice belt. Since this is gonna be a calamari, Seeing the males, the yeah, mural. I don't have the bad males here. Yeah, like this. I have my friends who are purists, Star Wars. They don't want to kill me right now. I'm deviating totally from canon. Okay. Like totally like a hundred times deviating from canon. My friends are silots. They don't like it. So, now let's start doing the calamari, the real one, the one I like it much. So this guy is like this. So. You know, we have it this way. You know, the calamari, I like this.
Okay, so this is my idea of an uh, Abraham Montgomery. <laughs> this is my real idea. Let me see on the other side, this little fella here. Yeah. By the way, if you don't even notice in nature, calories I mean squids are totally colored. They have a bunch of colors. They they come from oranges to brownish, but uh, they have a lot of color and they produce light. They have like a they are fluorescent, they have like a photoluminescence. This is my idea. This little fellow. Yeah, this is pretty much a calamari, like a real one. But the concept art, they said, well, concept art is something that it didn't exist, and you have to make something like looks like. Yeah, because you cannot interact with somebody just like that. But if you ask me, how can I, could I be communicated? Have you seen Soiber from Futurama series? We were just talking like that. They was moving the tentacles. So this Mon Calamari, who has been moving these tentacles, like uh, taking, it's a drop, <laughs> or something like that. Instead of, it's a drop. Could be like, it's a drop, it's a drop, something like that. So when you are the, the artist, you have the, not the power, but the beauty of just create this universe to whatever you want it. So you start fitting this into whatever. You want to have a, a squid like this, and you know that you have this guy to have like this little graphics. Not like tattoos, but graphics in some parts. And uh, they just use limbs because they don't want to explain to the people how a uh, guy who's tentacles in, instead of fingers 
can uh, you know arrange or rearrange can handle things but just remember this you put an octopus the octopus can easily open a can from inside can easily open so an octopus can do that so the octopus if you put like some sort of like a lock from the doors no doorknobs they can open doorknobs too so they are not like useless kind of uh, slimy animals they are pretty strong so this guy uh, by the way this guy is a very 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 uh, advanced species of mollusk well this is my idea among calamari right now this is start doing the line art let's make me a guy like this and now uh, we'll start doing the line art uh, where's the line art anyway. oh yeah these are my pencils i'm gonna start using the realistic and uh, no the tick yeah the tick sketchy oil so this guy is gonna be what color what color are the mon calamaris because i don't want you to be so much i like these guys i like, like uh, pinkish or yellowish or oh, this guy here yeah it's like a gray this guy is full colors by the way this is a calamari calamari this is a squid it's full colors but the guys they were like this So yes, it's like, uh, but why the, 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 the models, they don't have these eyes. They don't need these things. I don't know where they uh, actually, they are aquatic. They don't need nostrils at all. I don't know. At all. They, they don't have, a, they have a different system, a respiratory system than fishes. This guy looks like a fish. Let's look. Uh, probably something like this in this vicinity. Yeah, probably those in this vicinity. Yep. Okay, so I'm gonna put this guy in this vicinity. Yeah. I will not try to use too much pointing angles in the in the, um, in the character because pointing angles are considered many of the time as something like a bad like a bad guy. The bad guy has pointy angles, so the bad calamari, the bad squid has pointy angles. So yeah, I don't want to go that way. I want to make given the tentacles. They are not pointy, they are just like this. And this is also considered this another lesson about art. Um, probably you have a preference of art, and you, you are like me, probably, and you love many things that are medieval but true is mm, 
probably you get a client that asks you to do something like a culture like this for like a cyberpunk or a science fiction novella or something like a look looks like a, one of the non-canon books of the Star Wars so you you have to figure out how that works instead of saying no I don't do that I just don't like it because you are losing a business there and uh, actually this is pretty much a business Nice. What I'm using uh, this so much, I seen uh, tutorials of people doing this in another way. It's like, you know, when they are making the lines of the line art, they are using, they are doing just like this. Yeah, because I want to be exact, I want to be clean in the lines, and the less I have this of union here so it's bad for me I like it more so this is a personal preference but also is Okay, this is pretty much we're gonna call like the living online art.
Okay. So this is the Arduino Morgan model. This is my idea. It's using an actual script. So let's just start painting this actual script. Do is create layer here and um, yeah, information. So, oh yeah, this guy is like a brownish, but I don't want this guy. I want this guy here. This is un Lodigo Vulgaris or Lodigo Vulgaris. Yeah, I want this. Okay, so first we have to make this guy empty. Actually, I want this guy to be really more. This is the middle tone. I'm going to start with the middle tone. Okay, so this is the middle tone. Yeah, pleasure. Oh, that's one. That was my wife. So this is the middle tone, and this guy. So if you make like an L here, probably you don't see it, but let me show you. Uh, probably you don't see it too. You need to see this, for example, where my layers. And Like this, probably, so you know when I'm creating a new layer. Okay, so uh, let me show you where I was. I was here, so I described this kind of L. See, hope you can see it. Okay, so I'm making this little L. What's this L for? Oh, this to make uh, a kind of a more natural kind. Spot and I tend to make this a little boring, so I will start you know, making this.
okay this is my approach you can just do this it's nice right see Looks like a nice thing so we're gonna start making the colors go ahead ask me anything I can see the chat from here guys so I like this guy a lot Oh, I almost forgot. There is a part that is cool. The light part. Which is gonna be this guy. And also this guy too here. And this guy in some parts. My like guys. So let's just start making the video. Oh, 
an hour. Just not that bad. It's always four. So we're going to create a new layer because in this layer is gonna be this guy. But I don't want this guy to be normal I want to multiply. And it's gonna be like this. <laughs> Overlaying looks nice. I guess I prefer in darkening or multiplying. Darkening is okay, but multiplying is better. Color board. Hmm, color board is nice. Hmm, no, I guess I'm better carrying multiplying.
this, but this are smaller one. So what do you think guys? You like it? Okay, so, so far this is... Let me do the eyes again. Okay. I put some more. Some more shadows here.
okay, this is the face. And I do a little more experimentation here. And it has some push. Okay, looks nice. Looks pretty much like the calamari <laughs> on the screen. Do it this way, 100%. So this is the pretty much the that I. This is the army not mon calamari. This is my idea using a calamari, a real one. And uh, right now, let's gonna do our guy, which is the. Clothes. Mm -hmm. I like these clothes. They are like rich, greenish, some kind of greenish. Yeah. So this is the middle. This greenish. No, you are supposed to be here. Okay, thank you. Okay, and this here is going to be like any area.
Okay, let's start doing some.
Let's see. Oh, yeah. Actually, the, the medals or the insignias that he has in the chest, uh, they are in colors, but in mine, I'm not going to make in color, some color because I like colors. Alright, you have some colors. So, I'm going to go back to my, my traditional. So let's start with the uh, reddish.
Polish. Yes, it's finished. Hope you like, guys. This is my uh, interpretation of uh, Admiral Bon Calamari, which is also an actual calamari, a ministry. So this is um, comes with that actually. If you were, you know, having the task of interpret uh, the given interpretation of this admiral. Instead of doing, you know, the regular one that it looks like a fish and trying to do something like this and just thinking that probably it call it it's a trap, it's a trap, it's a trap or something like that. So yeah, this is my interpretation. We did this in one hour twenty-seven. We're getting faster guys. That's so cool. Well, thank you so much guys to join me. I hope you uh, you really enjoy this. And uh, um, just remember, this was brought to you by me. I have no sponsor, so if you can help me out and subscribe to this channel, it's for free. It doesn't have any price. I will appreciate it. Just uh, start, you know, sharing my uh, my videos, my art. I will appreciate it too. And also, if you want to uh, help out this, uh, this artist, there is this something that you can do for me. Just go to this place, coffee, K O hyphen F I dot com slash Gus Duenas Art, and just buy my coffee, whatever the price you want. I guess the less price is like three bucks. Amen. Who doesn't have three bucks? Just help me out. Any anything will be nice. And if you convert like a patron to me, like you know, buy me a bunch of coffees, I will give you um yeah, now is the is the address from coffee.com. I will give you a nice uh nice ink of yourself being like a, whatever. For that reason you have to buy me like a coffee, like a Two, three, uh, two times per week during a month, and I'll give you for free, actually for free. It's only to guys who buy me coffee, um, more than one time, by the way. An ink interpretation of you being a comic book character or a hero or whoever you want to be. I will appreciate that, and uh, thank you so much uh, for joining me. And uh, remember, just subscribe, just hit the button, subscribe. You share my channel with your friends, and I will appreciate that. Thank you. So